Okay, I just wanted to come on and explain to everybody what mock imbalance basically means. So if you go into Google, you can get the you know official definition. But um, if I can paraphrase it, it's basically liquidity that's given to the market makers in order to execute trades for the next day. And this could affect the price of your stock drastically to the upside or to the downside but i'm going to show you how i use it to benefit off of it when i'm trading it but what you need essentially is you need a news source if you go to fast stock if you go to twitter and you subscribe to fast stock market news turn your notifications on you'll be able to get these in live time so if you look at the timestamp here it was 345 early mock and balance was three 300 million to the sell side so let's go to the chart one minute chart in trading view apple you'll see at that time period we had uh the price rolled over a little bit and then we ripped why did it go up let's check it out at 350 the mock imbalance comes out that it was 3.1 billion to the buy side so you'll see that affected in the stock price let's look how that affects the actual we moved up what a whole dollar but what what, what does that come to so Let's see, so we ran, we ran a whole percent, you know, a little over a dollar. What did that do to the actual stock? These were zero dated options for the last 10 minutes of the closing. 140 calls, right? They were trading them for about 70 cents. They, so basically, we sold off about 40% down to about $50, and then we absolutely ripped into close and this wasn't even all of it i mean into the closing we uh, this thing this stuff ran to like 230 so you're talking about a, about a 500 percent return in a matter of 10 10 minutes this is how significant it is to trade news okay so this is what i do this is what i have taught people and this is what i've learned so have a news source up so that way you can take advantage of some of these news plays and um, and know how to play them all right so if you want more information about other educational you know things you can learn from trading follow me on twitter follow me on um, instagram and also follow me on youtube but on twitter i actually post my trading strategy and i and i post trades that i'm getting into trades that i'm getting out of and you can ask me questions on there so Look forward to seeing you, and I hope you remain profitable. Bye-bye.